Welcome to Wadix. In this video, we will cover the features of the admin section on the Wadix platform. The admin section makes it easy to manage your users, view organizations, and create automated reports at the click of a button. The home page displays the most recent user developments in the Wadix platform, including the last logins, recently created users, and the offline meters detected so far today. The user tab lists all of the people who have access to your Wadix platform. If we want to create a new user, we can input their basic info and allow them to set their own password on first login or create one for them. Wadix currently supports eight different languages and is rapidly increasing their offerings. Select the role to identify with the user, and then choose a plan. Plans restrict the level of access that a user has to certain functionalities on the Wadix platform. The various plans and their levels of access can be viewed under this tab. Once a user is created, you can see their information, history, and the organizations they belong to. Add specific organizations or sites to control what data appears on their platform interface. Users can also be edited or deleted at any time. The Organizations tab manages current and new organizations. Click on the button to add an organization to the list and associate it with one of your partners. All of the corresponding sites and metered points will be displayed under the organization. To add a new site, Click on the button and add the name and location of the site, along with the contact information of the site manager. It is important to input the address because Wadix uses geolocation to automatically upload weather data for each site, making it easy to correlate energy consumption with temperature or heating degree days. Add a meter to your site by choosing the data type, sampling rate, units, kind of reading, and the channel parameter type. You can add an appliance to a meter in the same way. The users who have client or internal access to the organization can be viewed under the Users tab. Report definitions allow you to customize automated energy reports to save you time and simplify the way you provide energy insights to your clients. A report containing the pre-specified information will be sent monthly by email for every active site in the recipient's dashboard. Type in the report name, description, and energy type. The transmission day indicates the day of the month that the report is sent, and the time shift in months allows you to use data from previous months in this month's report, i.e. the May data being sent out in the July report. Wadix offers 10 different analysis templates that can be added to your report, including trend analysis, active power, operations analyzer, and top consuming areas. Select and deselect the information you wish to share, and click on the right to view an example of the template and see exactly how the data is presented. The white-labeled version will be branded to your own company's logo, color scheme, header, and footer. Select the users to receive the report at the bottom and save to ensure that the report will be sent to these people each month. The utility bill report is particularly useful to send a flexible invoice to clients. You can choose the day of the month the bill is sent, the previous balance, how much has been paid, the tax, and left and bottom comments. You can even add sections to the bill to include unique pricing, such as peak demand or extra charges. The preview displays how all of the information is formatted in the bill. Use the filters on the list to search for and edit reports that have already been created. You can preview and download any of the reports to check that the analysis is appropriate before it's sent to your clients. The Data Monitor tab displays a straight query into our Wadix database, which can be helpful to check meter installations or troubleshoot data errors. Simply choose a metered points and the time of the period of the data, and the dashboard will display the numerical values received by Wadix. These values include active power, reactive power, apparent power, current, voltage, power consumption, and line-to-line -line voltage. Thank you for watching. Learn more about each of the tabs on the Wadix dashboard by watching our other instructional videos. If you have any questions, please visit our website or contact us at support at